Hello and welcome to sapyard.com. We are ready with a detailed course for the freshers and beginners in SAP who would like to learn ABAP programming. Many of our experienced SAP functional friends also requested for a course on SAP Advanced Business Application Programming and here we are. If you know nothing about SAP but still want to be a programmer for SAP, this is the course you need to enroll for. By the end of this training, you will learn enough to start your career in a SAP ABAP programming. There is no prerequisite for this training. Anyone who wants to learn SAP ABAP programming from scratch, this is the right course. We will commence the course assuming the participants do not know anything about SAP. In fact, they might not even know that SAP is not called SAP, but SAP. We will give the participants high-level overview of SAP, different modules in SAP, architecture of SAP, commonly used terminologies in SAP, and also talk about the system landscape, offshore onshore models, and the different jargons like BRD, FDD, TDD, UTP, waterfall, and agile models. With some theory and concepts, we will start our technical session on SAP Data Dictionary. Every day, we will have hands-on exercises to concrete the concepts with practical examples. ABAP is the programming language developed by SAP for programming business applications within the SAP environment. The main role of ABAP program in the application layer is the processing and formatting of data from the database layer and its interaction with the user's input from the presentation layer. ABAP provides integrated database access to multiple database systems through the use of OpenSQL. In this training, we will learn all the building blocks of robust ABAP programming. We will teach you everything you need to learn for ABAP programming in this course. Clean code does not only help the current developer but also the future developers who support them. We will showcase the best practices of SAP ABAP programming. We will learn about modularization and debugging in details. File upload and download is a very common requirement in every SAP project. We will teach our participants how to handle the files. Also, we will understand the different SAP program calls and memory management in SAP ABAP programming. Every alternate week, the ABAP developers get the request to create some sort of reports. ALV is one of the most commonly used reports in SAP and we will surely show you how to build an ALV report in this course. There are many variants of ALV reporting and the trainer will teach the most commonly used ones. We will also learn how to send email using ABAP programs in this course. Dialog programming or the module pool programming is a special programming in SAP ABAP. It is more than the normal report. You need to design your screens, buttons, actions and events in this form of programming. There are some specific steps involved in module tool programming and the trainer will make you comfortable with the real project example scenario. In short, we will focus on the crude operations in module tool programming where crude stands for C for create, R for read, U for update and D for delete. SAP comes with a set of processes and modules, but businesses vary from client to client and they say one size does not fit all. In those cases where the standard SAP does not help, we need to make some enhancements and modifications to the standard SAP objects. There are different concepts like user exists, customer exists, program exists, baddy, enhancement points, sections and enhancement spots. We will cover each topic one by one and help you master them. BDC and BAPI has been there in SAP since inception. Even with S4 HANA, BDC could not be killed and BAPI was born immortal. So how can we miss these two topics? On top of it, we will also cover how to create web services in SAP and also how to consume external web services in SAP. This will be one very interesting and very useful session. 
ALE iDoc is one of the preferred means of communications in SAP. It has some unique keywords and steps like segments, basic types, message types, etc. We will help our ABAP trainees to understand the concepts of EDI, ALE and iDoc with some real-time use cases of inbound and outbound iDocs. SAP has evolved a lot in recent times. To walk shoulder to shoulder with the modern ABAP developers, we will also cover the new ways of writing SAP ABAP programs. We will use Eclipse based ADT for these sessions. And we will showcase how to write the same age old ABAP program with the new age syntax and flavors. It not only makes the programming short and easy, but at the same time it is more optimized and easy to support. Finally, before we wrap the course, we will cover Core Data Services or CDS. CDS is available after ABAP 7.4 Service Pack 05 and it is one of the pillars of ABAP programming model in S4 HANA. In this training, we will teach the participants all the fundamentals of Core Data Services. We will cover CDS with parameters, CDS with associations and also show how to extend the CDS views and consume them in ABAP program. CDS is one new topic which every ABAP developer should learn and master. Let us look into some important date, time and other information. The first day of the training is on 17th October 2020 at 7.30 am IST. This time is GMT plus 5.5 hours, so if you are in Europe, Africa or West Asia, you might not be able to join. Thank you very much for supporting and encouraging SAP Yard. Please like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, LinkedIn and Instagram. Please do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that bell icon. Please email us at mailsapyard at gmail.com or whatsapp us at plus one 251-727-9273 if you have any queries. Looking forward to seeing you live on the training day. Have a safe and wonderful time ahead. Thank you very much. Join the live classes. This time suits well for the participants from Indian subcontinent, East Asia, Australia, New Zealand, North and South America. We are open for registration till October 5th, 2020. And the payment of the fee and enrollment process should be complete by October 12, 2020. The link to enroll for this training is in the description section of this video. Each class will be little over 2.5 hours and the whole course will take more than 25 hours. Recording of the class will be provided after each live session and participants will have lifetime access to these recordings. There is no prerequisite for this course. Participants with no previous programming knowledge in any programming language is welcome. Also, if you do not know anything about SAP but still want to learn ABAP programming, you can enroll and learn in this course. S4 HANA 1809 server access will be provided till November 30, 2020. The server access is included in the training fee and you do not need to pay anything extra for it. Please check the description section of this video for the course fee and the other details.